I'll show you how to fix your Wi-Fi not working on your Hisense TV and what to do if it won't go and connect to a network as well. If you found this guide useful then please consider subscribing, once you've done that then please consider leaving a like and let's get right into this guide. If you find the Wi-Fi on your Hisense TV doesn't seem to be working or it isn't connecting then let's get into some fixes. So firstly let's head to our network settings and our internet settings. So hop onto remote like so, tap on the home button, this one here like so and then you should be taken to this page here and then what you need to do is go and tap down to settings like this and then go and tap OK on settings. Then right at the top of settings should be network which you can then go and tap OK or select on. Then what you can do is go down to setup connection like this, choose if you want to go and use wireless or wired. If you're finding that one of these isn't working, I'd recommend using the other. For example, if you're currently using wired and that isn't working, switch to wireless. And if possible, if you're currently using wireless, switch to wired, but that does mean you need a literal wire going from your router uh, to your TV. So while you're sort of repairing this, it may be worth placing your TV right next to your router to then go and use the other connection. However, if you really wanna get wireless working, then we can continue using wireless. So tap OK or select there, and it's then gonna go and look for networks which are available. Your TV network should then load. So if you're finding that no networks are appearing here, this is likely because your TV is too far away from your Wi-Fi router. Like for example, if you're maybe first setting your TV up or you've moved your TV to a different location, then this is just because your TV is literally too far away from the connection. However, if you haven't moved your TV and the Wi-Fi used to work fine, then keep watching as we're going to get into some more fixes. So yeah, uh, if your sort of if, if your TV is in a new location or you're recently setting Wi-Fi up, then simply move it closer to your router or try and get a Wi-Fi booster or something like that. However, if the Wi-Fi used to work on your TV fine and you haven't moved it, then there are some other fixes we can try. So what I recommend doing is restarting your TV. So to do that, there's actually a combination of keys we need to go and press. So what you need to press is the home button five times, then up, and then you go and press the rewind button twice and the fast forward button twice. Now we'll do that all together. So I'll press the home button five times, one, two, three, four, five, then the up button, then rewind and fast forward like that. And then your TV is gonna start moving sort of randomly like that, and it's gonna go and freeze. And this is all part of the restart process. And this will take a minute or two. In a moment, your TV is gonna go black, and then it will turn back on again, and then I think it may even turn back off again as well. So basically, it's like a reset on the system. So just be patient. Once your TV is finished restarting, then go and see if the Wi-Fi is working or if you can go and connect to the internet. If it still isn't, there's another thing we can try, but we need to do this in the system operations menu. So to get here, once again, we need to come onto the remote and there's a certain key combination that we need to go and click. And that's going to be pressing the home button five times and then you need to go and press uh, fast forward, play, pause, rewind, then play and then fast forward. We'll do that all together now. So uh, home button five times, one, two, three, four, five, then fast forward, play and rewind, then play, fast forward. And then as you can see, we then get this platform secret screen appear. Uh, let me focus, there we go. And in the bottom right, we've then got some options. So tap up to systems operations menu, tap okay or select there. And then what you want to do is go to network menu and click on disable network pings like so. As you can see, it now switches to enable, which is what you want. Then go and press cancel. And then what you can do is go on to remote and press on the home button just like this. And now what we need to do is just go and restart our TV again. Just like earlier, to go and restart our TV again, you press the home button five times, then the up arrow, then the rewind button twice and the fast forward button. So tap it one, two, three, four, five, then the up arrow. And then what you need to do is press that twice, fast forward twice. And then as you can see, the TV starts to go a bit random. It will freeze and then it will restart. So I'll catch up with you once it's gone and restarted. Hopefully now your Hisense TV's Wi-Fi is working and you can go and connect to a network. If it still isn't, you may need to go and get in contact with Hisense. And also because we went and disabled that ping setting, what you can do is always go and rewind uh, your this video and you can find out how we disabled it. And then you can go and enable it again if you'd like to see if it will then work with it being enabled again. So yeah, if you guys found this useful, please consider leaving a like. Peace.